Hey, what is going on pros and pros? This is Mr. Lyman HD here and welcome to another drinks review. Today we are reviewing Monster's new punch and it's on specifically the pipeline punch version. Not to be confused with Monster's other monster punch, but this is the mixed, the uh, mixed punch, which is more of a cherry side. So, and again, don't confuse this with a Monster Ultra. It looks very similar to a Monster Ultra can, but it's not an Ultra, I'll tell you that for a fact. So, I'll give you guys a 460 of the can. So like I said, we have a very, very awesome looking can design. We have the usual embossed uh, look, which is expected on the Monster can, which this is not. Um, the, most of the can, well, the whole can is pink, which is a nice change actually. That'll brighten up my uh, wall of colors. And then we'll just sort of see a bit of description on the back, which I'll read to you in a second, and then the ingredients and stuff. On the bottom we have nothing, and on the top everything's all standard and sort of included in the pull ring. So, interestingly, this was £1.35, which is weird, because every other monster I'm aware of, even this one if it's price marked, nope, every other monster I've been aware of is generally £1.19. So to charge £1.35 is just weird, and that's pricey, you know what I mean? That's almost one fifty for a can. Like, that's a bit pricey, you know what I mean? Rockstar and Relentless are always a pound a can, or whatever, out of corner shops. That's a tad pricey, so you know, I'm starting to think they're upping their prices a bit, which is not good because it would honestly put me away from paying £1.40 you know, for a can. But, uh, anyways, so around the top we have Inst Instatol plus P vitamins, L cartonine, taurine, pipeline punch, yes, uh, punch energy. So, I'll just read the uh, description to you guys Banzai Pipeline, the world's most famous wave on Hawaii's fabled North Shore, comes alive just a few brief months every winter. In honour of this epic force of nature, we created Monster Pipeline Punch, the perfect blend of the best flavours Hawaii has to offer, passion fruit, orange and guava. So it's passion fruit, orange and guava, and then it's monsterized with a full load of our famous energy blend. And just like the wave it was named for, it is destined to become a legend, unleash the beast. <laughs> so yeah, it's um, you know, one of those cool story type monsters, you know, and all that, so you know, fair enough. Um, so like I said, this isn't a Monster Ultra, and the sugar content is, 10 grams per 100 mil, and that is 51 grams uh, per 500 mil, or per can, which doesn't make sense, it would be 50 grams, but anyways. Uh, it contains our usual vitamins, vitamin B6, B12, panophenic, oh no, it doesn't contain panophenic acid, it contains B6, B12, niacin, and riboflavin, no panophenic acid, how interesting. Caffeine content is uh, the usual 32 milligrams per 100 mil, and uh, for the sweeteners, the, the ultras don't contain... Um, Aspartame, but this is full sugar, so it shouldn't. It only contains sucralose, so it's all good there. So, anyways, um, like I said, you think it's an ultra, but it's really not. It's really going to play on your mind. Um, they should have made it into an ultra, but there we are. So, anyways, it's nice and cold. I have got a cup. Let's get straight into it. Hopefully, it won't explode over me. So, the colour, this is a weird one. Orange passion fruit guava. It's not going to taste of orange. It's probably going to be passion fruit with the monster blend, but uh, we will find out. There we are. In fact, my mate actually picked this up for me. Um, like I said, it's a new flavour in the UK. It may exist in America, it probably already does and has done for ages. But I know here in England, we've only just started seeing these come over here. So, you know, bear with us. Um, and uh, yeah, it did cost me about pound 35. Oh, okay. Was not expecting the actual orange for the most part. So of course it is fizzy, as you can expect with a uh, monster drink, and it is non-see-through, and uh, yeah, it's a nice, it's it's almost like a competition orange colour, that makes sense. You know like you got competition orange on like a car or something, it looks like that, really really strong, uh, strong orange, but kind of like not bright, if that makes sense. The smell, oh wow. It smells of, it definitely smells of passion fruit, you know, in there, but there's a hint of orange, there's actually a hint of orange in there, and I wasn't expecting much orange. Hmm. Nevertheless, let's uh, taste some. Hopefully this isn't just orange. Oh, wow. That is so nice. That is so, so nice. Shame it's full sugar, but that is really nice. Wow. So for the for the guava side of it, not really, not really much guava in there. But the passion fruit and the orange mixed in with that monster blend, oh my god, that is amazing. That is 
that's really, really nice. So even though it's full sugar and everything like that, it doesn't taste super, super sweet. But I'd say, I'd say it's definitely more, it's not really syrupy. It just definitely tastes sweeter and sugary more than you'd expect than a normal sugary drink. I mean, like I said, 10 grams is dead on the average of, you know, the per 100 ml sugar, but it is a bit sweeter than usual. So if you do like a bit of a sweeter, then this is another one for you. Uh, like I said, as the flavour is concerned, it's a lovely passion fruit blend with the orange, and it definitely has got its monster flavour in there, because you do notice the uh, mon monsterized, if you want to call it, flavour in the ultras, and it definitely has that monster taste in there, just a little bit. But for the most part, the, the flavours are amazing, like they don't taste, you know, they don't taste fake or artificial or anything like that. There's a lovely, it's almost like Rubicon passion with a bit sweeter, and then mixed with orange, and then monster ties, monster ties, whatever the word is. And that is just amazing drink. Really, really nice. Oh, that is so good. Of course, it's been in the fridge for 24 hours, so it's nice and cold. That's so good. So yeah, that's what I'll say about it. Not much guava. Again, the guava may be in there just for overall flavour. But for the most part, no. It's a passion fruit and orange, so she's monsterized. Absolutely beautiful. What can I compare it to on my wall? Well, there isn't really an orange and passion fruit because you've only got orange drinks or passion fruit drinks on the own. I mean, yeah, you've got Relentless Orange Crush, but that's orange and you've got, you know, you've got Rockstar Extra, it's Tropical Orange or whatever it is, and that's orange, you know. There isn't really a passion fruit energy drink which is then mixed in with orange. And I know you've got monster ultra sunrise which is an orange one but this is definitely more of a passion fruity hawaiian type thing which they've gone for which i honestly really agree with they've gone for the theming of that kind it really does make sense and it wouldn't make sense for it to be you know orange because it does say pipeline punch kind of like passion fruit you know punch type thing so that does really really go well with the branding and the whole punch and passion fruit thing they've done that monster eye so overall that's just a really really nice drink really really impressed with that that definitely gets a thumbs up for me and um i tell you what i reckon that is so nice i reckon that is definitely my top that is in my top 10 favorite energy drinks already and before you ask my most favorite energy drink is rockstar's extruance blueberry pomegranate and acai that one is amazing but as always guys i won't keep it longer if you find it then buy it hey ho but like i said unfortunately for me it's full sugar and i will not be really buying it if it does appear in all the shops because i just i do not agree with full sugar drinks but um there we go so as always guys thanks for watching and i'll see you all later